Now, KSBW Weather with meteorologist Ferdinand Holum. Welcome back, everybody, and a happy Father's Day to all the dads out there. Hopefully you're enjoying the day, relaxing, and, well, doing maybe just about nothing. Across the country, severe weather reports. No tornadoes, that is good news there, but a lot of green dots out there, golf ball sized to even baseball sized hail in a lot of these areas here where you saw some damage to some cars with a lot of windshields broken down or windshields uh, smashed in, I guess you would say. Trees down, power outages and that type of thing. Look at this area right here, it just blew up last night. So that's where the main uh, focus of the storms are right now. There's some storms up here in the Great Lakes. As we go through the day, there's still an enhanced risk of severe thunderstorms along this line as we go through the afternoon. Out west, I have pretty quiet, just a big ridge of high pressure, a few little showers moving through the Pacific Northwest. Temperatures, Seattle, nice, 73, SFO, San Francisco, 80s, Denver, 80, 81, St. Louis, some 80s out toward New York. Of course, you got some humidity out there. Heat in Dallas, 95, 113, Phoenix. Got some airport delays. LAX, they've got fog down there, so delays there. Seattle, they've got low visibility, some rain showers up there. Everybody else across the country right now, green lights. Hey, hey Santa Cruz. Boy, this is just beautiful, and this is the place I think a lot of people are going to be. A couple people out there starting their morning workout a little bit. Glassy waters. And there was a little bit of fog trying to form out on the bay, but it ain't. It's not there, so no low clouds, no fog this morning, but a big, big, big dome of high pressure. Over the western United States today, the ridge is directly overhead, so today will be the hottest day of the week as it shifts to the east a little bit there. Maybe some thunderstorms in the Sierra Nevada, isolated thunderstorms, maybe some high based, maybe even some uh, dry lightning out there to be noted, especially as things heat up there. High pressure beginning on Monday will slowly shift a little bit to the east, so Monday and Tuesday will just be ever so slightly cooler, and then by the time we get to Wednesday, we're back into the triple digits as this ridge of high pressure sneaks its way back in toward us. So the temperature trend, the actual uh, weather advisory, the heat advisory that originally was going through Monday was extended to Tuesday, extended to Wednesday, and now the advisory goes out to Thursday. So uh, another five days including today of a lot of heat. Boy, it started yesterday, so we don't get those heat waves that last that long very often. Santa Barbara, LA, San Diego, middle 70s, 105 to 110 down the Central Valley. Vegas, 112, Palm Springs, 114. Uh, that's not too big of a deal for those guys. Ben Lomond, 102, that's pretty hot. 72 for Monterey, 80 in Salinas, beautiful air. And then down the Salinas Valley, Soledad 92, pushing 100 for King City. Record in King City is 102. Gilroy record is 102. So, yay, we could we'll flirt with some records. Hollister 98. Here's your case for eight day forecast. So, a few very nice days for the beaches here coming up the next couple days there, even into Tuesday. Tuesday will be the first day of summer, by the way. And then we slowly, gradually cool things down here all the way through Sunday and get that marine layer back in full force there. And then for our inland high temperatures, Look at this, 103, 99, 99, 101, and then we've added Thursday, 99, and then finally by Friday, we start to cool things down back into the 70s or more 80s, I guess, uh, toward the end of the week. There'll be some 70s in there too, but Ooh, a few days of some hot weather and Bianca is just saying yeehaw. <laughs> At this rate, we're going to have a whole <laughs> week of sunny goodness. Yeah, and, and some of these now will cross into your days off. Yes. Yes, Thankfully. see, that, that's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Sounds good. Thank you, you Bert. <laughs>